quiet on the set. Show me your pick Saturday night once again. It is November 26, 2022. Yes. Charles yes. Green, Brendan B. Squared, the lovely Sandra alongside. What's up, guys? Don't look at my eye, people. Well, we weren't going to until you said it. Put nope. on a patch. Put a patch <laughs> on it. <laughs> uh <laughs> Tape We're a butt over it. <laughs> ah, ah. There you go. There it is. There you go. <laughs> Doing right. good, T. How about yourself? Nice doing Saturday. good, man. Good. Good. Doing good. good. Charles, it's how you Saturday. doing? Saturday. Doing good. I hope everybody's doing well. Yeah. Yeah. Thanksgiving weekend. Yep. Right slam dam in the middle of it. Yeah. Yeah. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Usually I have to get my wife's old maternity pants out to, you know, because it's really stretchy. So. I know. <laughs> Not the stretchy pants. Oh, man. There's a lot of food, man. I know. I mean, it's just so good. I saw the second a lot time of food this third week. time. <laughs> Leftovers are the best. Oh, oh yeah. Nice, nice pick, Charles. Yeah. Pick. yeah. Heard that turkey put it right in with the gravy and on low and the slow uh -huh. turkey. Put it yeah. simmer and then serve all of them stuffing mashed You get the, the turkey stuffing cranberry sandwich. Yeah. You know, are you guys doing food again? You know, we were on pause last the other I night. I didn't even mention. <laughs> That's messed up. I bought extra pies this year for, for me. I didn't have any pumpkin and I'm, I'm, I miss it. We had We had two apple pies, but... My sister-in-law. There was right apple, there was pumpkin, and there was pecan. And I was <laughs> really too full, but I, I did have a piece of apple. I, have a, I, I got a pumpkin pie here, so. You never have enough. You always have room for pie. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I actually Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. I yeah. bought a couple extra pecan pies. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good stuff. Um, I think I got yeah, half a one cool. left. Very nice. Yeah. Um, we're I talking like about you two tonight. You um, too. You too. One of the greatest rock bands of all time. Yeah, they're still going. Um, so they're actually they're could actually could be finished, said. That's they're finishing right. up. Uh, they're finishing up their tour. I think tomorrow. No, uh, Monday, in Europe. So. Huh? They're still yeah. touring. That's crazy. A lot to talk about with oh, yeah. U2. A lot of guitar picks from U2. Um, we'll talk about each member and show cool. you some good stuff, some new stuff um, happening too, some cool new stuff. We'll get into that, and we'll get into some 
10 shot rock and roll trivia yep. and that'll come your way about the one hour mark we're gonna we're gonna nice sorry about that which we're one are you giving give away? You, uh, uh, Eric Clapton. Oh, nice. Pick tonight. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Well, that's great. Yeah, Very man. cool. Yeah, man. Nice. So that's what we're playing for later. Nice. Um, some cool questions, though. Yeah. Always good questions. Yeah. Always. I try to write them. Um, fun and they are fun tonight. They are fun. Yeah, and the hard ones come at the right time. Mm hmm. Yeah. So. Yes, they do. I lost my chat. Where's my chat? It's in there. Um, oh, there they're, they're right there. They're right, right there. there. Right there. 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 <laughs> that song you hit it right in the head, brother. That's where, that's where you Talking guys are. Jeez. So, so let's let's do just that. Let's say hi in. to the chat. The chat can see the delay actually. That's my YouTube ah. streamyard. So now I'll you guys can out. actually see the delay. Ah. Cool. So I'm just opening up my chat and I'm seeing at the bottom Andy Carson. Andy. You, Andy. Right on. Right on, brother. Got a nice shirt from Andy. Thank you, Andy. Look at that. Yeah, look at him. Rocking that shirt, bro. Yeah, man. Yeah. Station 5, Chattanooga, Tennessee. Yeah. Proud. Nice and, nice and comfy. Yeah, dude. Thank nice. you very much, sir. It makes me right feel on. bad that all the time we we spent in in our criminal justice and in our training, we, we would always tease the fire people. <laughs> they always, the fire, bad. yeah, they always, the... <laughs> The law enforcement guys always tease the, the fire guys. They do it yeah, in every town, did. you know. But they all, you know, they're all they all love each other. They all every time we hear the fire truck, oh, it must be a bear run. Yeah. <laughs> That's messed up. You know what though? The, the fi firefighters cook way better than the cops. I'll tell you that. Yes, they do. Yes, they way do. better. So. Yeah. Well, they got well, time. That, oh, <laughs> Sorry. Oh man. They deserve all the no, respect. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, it's that's it's that's tough work and very respectable. God bless. It is. Them, I mean, you know? there, there was mutual respect, but they're but, the oh, they're they're, they're all yeah, the, they're all heroes. Yeah, they're all heroes, man. The jabbing was both ways. Don't get me wrong. They oh. made, they gave it to us just. As oh, if you're yeah, if you're if you're one or the other, yeah, you you have carte blanche to beat each other up, you know, <laughs> and they do. But Andy, yeah. thank you for everything that you do. Yes, sir. Yeah. Right yeah. There. Thank you, Andy. Um, so who else you Jeff got? Jeff K, I see, is here. Yeah, Christopher Live Sour in yeah. the house. Christopher. Ryan Hall in the house. Right. Metalworks. Hey, Jay hey. Turner in the house. What's Jay. up, dude? Oh hey. Just real quick, not to interrupt, but Jay sent me uh a photo of his new guitar pick. Did he say not to interrupt? He did. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> This is uh, the next guest generation for yeah, me. Yeah, I, I was pick. gonna show that. Oh, oh you no. were? Did I? Damn. No, 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 cool? no. Come on now, come on, come on with it. Wait a minute, that's the back. Uh, God. Now I'm all messed up. Wait a minute. Oh boy. Okay. Boom, boom. How your monks run? And then there's the other side, you guys. Nice. Right. Badass. That is and yeah. and they're coming to Salisbury, Tony. Yeah, uh, I know. Yeah. Well, you know that too. I'm messing it all yeah. up for you, aren't I? Yeah, no more steak. coffee for We're you. Talking about food now. Salisbury steak. No yeah. more coffee. You're cut off. We all got right. a show to catch Mean Street. <laughs> we are. I told the next Jay year. We're coming. <laughs> yeah. Jay, nice to see you, bro. There. Absolutely. Keith you Campbell in the house. What's up, brother? Hey, What's Keith. Up, good to see you, bro. Guitar Man 45, I'm seeing. If Guitar you're just man. jumping in here, right on, brother. say hi. We are have lost our place here in the chat. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. So say hi. It's we can always start too. at the bottom, right? Quentin oh, James yeah. in the house. Right on, Pops. Right on, Quentin. 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 All right. Yeah. <clears throat> Nothing wrong with getting lost in the chat, man. 
no what is your no better place to be. Well, let's let's see. see. I'm, I'm trying to scroll <laughs> upwards. Like your Zach Thong right on Zach. <laughs> we love you anyways. Oh boy. Let me pull that out again. Where is it even? Alright. I'm think. back to the bottom. The man. Straight up. The myth. So nice to see you guys tonight. Welcome. It's yes. Saturday night. Hope your Thanksgiving weekend is going swell. Hope you um, got to see everybody that you hadn't seen and want to see. And hope you didn't get to see those you didn't want to see. Right. So I hope it all worked out. Um, but, yeah, a lot to be thankful for this Thanksgiving holiday season. Um no complaints here. I had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Um, yeah, was able to get some stuff done this weekend around the house. So yeah, yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Um, yeah. Nice. So while let me mention this too on on the channel here, I put up eight new guitar pick videos yeah, was um, awesome one. of stuff that I've just been setting aside for the past six months and got them all videoed out and put away and there's eight of them up here on the channel new ones and a lot of cool guitar picks yeah. um, they're all short videos so yeah check them out yeah yeah man yeah, I barely caught any of them yet, but yeah, what I did see looked really cool, Tony. Those that was yesterday, hits, and that's we show some of that stuff or a lot of stuff live here on the show if it's new, but but it goes into a jar until I have enough to make these videos, and mm. I was way past having enough to make these videos. So. Oh. Very yep. cool, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so Christopher I want to ask you watching he's in the chat why aren't you at the machine shop tonight watching Machine Head with Dave Z yeah I, I would really like to know that too Maybe he is, and uh, I can hear that. Sorry. Mm. Yeah, it's, I'm printing out some stuff. I'm doing that art, art and craft show. I've been doing this whole weekend, and uh, the skulls, you know, the skull pick holders. Huh? Yeah. I just, I just brought them there just to, to you know, put picks in them for display. People are like, hey, can, is that for sale? I'm like, sure. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> so I ran out of them, so I had to print some. So I apologize for the... Yeah. <laughs> Just curiosity, Brendan. The yeah. people who are buying those, they're not necessarily getting them for picks, are they? Because you could use business you do business cards. You could do... Yeah. The, right. the, um, well, the skulls, uh, they're doing for picks. But the other ones, you know, the mm -hmm. ones with the spring on them, they're putting yeah. business cards in those. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah. yeah. How many are you taking tomorrow? I got skulls. Um, well, I'm printing. It takes freaking ten hours to print three, so that's what that's what takes long. So, uh, I've got another five hours on these. <laughs> I'm not staying up that late, so it's going to be three more, and I think I got two, so five more. But yeah, yeah. yeah it's... But uh, hey, you know, if people want them, I'll 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 make them. Why not? Oh, yeah. Very cool. You know? Yeah, dude. Very cool. Having a good time. Haven't sold a, a, a guitar yet this year. Oh. Last year, last year was great. Look uh, at this. Why am I not there? Oh. That's wow. well played, Mr. Silva. Yeah. Well played, <laughs> yes, sir. That's good the answer. Right answer. It's the right answer. Now, I like the skulls, Brandon. Yeah. 
But I, I like these <laughs> even more. Yeah. Because these they had some they heft don't fall too. out. Yeah. Nope. They don't. Yeah, I sold a bunch of those too. Smaller versions, the you know, long flat ones. Mm -hmm. I think one I sent for you, Charles, right? Well, like throw it. Yeah, like that one. Yeah. On your desk yeah. or where you play, top of your head or something. <laughs> right on. Wow. <laughs> There's some stuff going on. What the hell? Okay, what? my mouse just clicked itself. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I told you I heard knocking earlier. Hey, R2, R3. It's good to see you, brother. Welcome, bro. Stick around. We'll share a normal activity in a minute. Hey. What's up, R2? Let's just fly across the room. <laughs> no, poltergeist. We've had a picture of flying across the picture. Really? Yeah. Crazy. And this is, yeah. And there's, I've seen some things here. That's crazy. I've been touched. Twice. Oh boy. I posted one picture on social media. Yeah. It was like a big fucking handprint right there on the camera. I didn't see that. I don't think I saw it. That was, it's on my Facebook. I think I put it on Instagram too. I couldn't believe it. I'm like the size of that hand. It's bigger than Ricky's even, and he's got a huge hand. Wow. Yeah. I, I It wow. woke me up, as a matter of fact. I thought, what the hell? And I woke up, and I'm like, why does my leg feel like a bruise? And I touch it, and you know how a bruise feels when you touch it. It hurts. And this mm -hmm. was like, damn. So then I'm fully awake, and I look down, and I see a handprint. It's like, Wow. Wow. That's crazy. So I went out and asked Ricky, I'm like, and he's like, I don't know anything about it. <laughs> yeah. So I'm like, I'm going use your cell phone and take the picture. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wow. That's some scary stuff. The first, the first time it, it touched my foot and I was just, you know, people say you get frozen in fear. It literally happened to me. I could not move. I could barely speak. I could barely breathe. I'm trying to move my arm to get Ricky's attention because he's laying right. He's already falling asleep and I was getting ready to fall. I just turned the TV off and I was laying there, my eyes shut, and someone comes up and does this to my foot. Like, brushes it and squeezes it. And I was like, <laughs> Throw solid, huh? Yeah. Solid. Goosebumps and shit. Could not. You know, can I tell you guys a quick little story? It's funny. You're telling that story. My ex-wife and I were talking about a month ago. She's a nurse, a traveling nurse. She was up north, um, New Hampshire. That's where she was. Okay. She was in this old house. And what it is, is it's like a um, uh, they, they rent rooms for like short term like two or three month periods of time for nurses who travel that's okay. what they do but it's this really old grand real badass mansion looking place so it's anyway, anyway, <laughs> well here's the here's what happened to her i believe every damn word of this too um she's laying in bed upstairs uh it's evening she's reading a book so she's sitting, laying in bed, reading a book, and she hears somebody playing the piano downstairs. Okay. Now mm -hmm. there's only at this time, there's a maid What's up, who comes Tommy? every day hey, and leaves around five, six o'clock. So this was in the, this was just before the maid was kind of getting ready to leave. This was getting, coming on to kind of a dinner time thing. And she hears the piano, but it's not really a song. It's just indescript notes, just like a child was hitting them. And so about two minutes later, this maid comes up to the door and knocks on the door very hastily. And, and my ex-wife's name is Lisa. And she says, she says, yes, come in. And the maid opens the door with this startled look in her face. She says, did you hear that? And my ex-wife goes, uh, she meets, hear what? And she goes, the piano. And she says, yeah. And the maid goes, I wasn't playing it. 
And then my, my ex-wife goes, okay. And then she goes, we're the only two people in this house. And so things got kind of creepy. The maid goes, I'm leaving. <laughs> so about five minutes later, she's sitting, laying in bed with a book. She feels something come up her leg, up kind of around her, and the pages on the book flip for three pages. And she was frozen stiff. She said the hairs on her arms were straight up and down. And uh, and then it just left. And I said, what did you do? Did you leave? She says, no, I didn't leave. I, I stayed. And I said, geez, I thought to myself, you need to call Sandra. I mean, that's kind of what I was thinking, right? And uh, yeah, so that's kind of a crazy story. But yeah, 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 yeah. And she stayed out. She stayed out another couple of weeks. She didn't see anything else through the rest of that period of time. Wow. But they were all telling like stories about it. Once it had yeah. come to light, the tales started coming out. Uh, <laughs> it's just a real old house with lots of generations who went through it. A lot of history, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's a trip. If you believe in that sort of thing. Well, it yeah. doesn't matter if you do, it sure believes in you, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can tell you it is real. I've been dead twice, I've been to the afterlife. So yeah, it's not, uh. it's not the end. Wow. I don't know why I went down that rabbit hole, you guys, but I think it was all because of Sandra. It's all Sandra's fault. That's what I'm, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. Told you I was a weirdo. Yeah, my kind of weirdo. I'm going to go in the chat. She comes, guys. Hey, Ben Tom's in the chat. It's good to see you, Tommy. I love you, man. Miss you, Tommy. Oh, I'm reading what Tommy's writing. Oh, dude, that's gnarly. Wow. Dude. Wow. That's a little scary. That is a little scary. Sandra used to do this on communication breakdown. I mean, uh, Squad Squad communication breakdown. Yeah. She talked about this stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I miss it a lot. I thoroughly love that channel. Wow. Hey, uh, what are we talking about tonight, you guys? Are we talking a little U2? What are we talking about? U2 action. U2 tonight. Yes, sir. I, I saw them uh, late 80s. I saw the Joshua Tree tour. I have it, never seen U2. They played in uh, the Hartford Civic Center, and that was around the time where uh, my mom worked at a beauty salon next to a Ticketmaster. So... Mm. She would always go, "Hey, you want to go see this show?" I'm like, uh, "Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I want to go see that show." Yeah, yeah. So she gave me some. They weren't great tickets, but they were good. I mean, you know, I was a, any a, seat upper was level, massive, you know. You know, yeah. You saw history, level. Brennan. You saw massive yeah. history. There, there's no chance of getting a pick up there, Tony. But you know, <laughs> uh, I ain't getting yeah. enough for it. But yeah, I guess they're pretty much biggest band in the world. You think? One of the, not the, yeah, yeah, they're, they're, they're Um, there, man. Just from album sales and Uh, and sheer ticket sales to concerts and just from everything, they, they got the numbers in every, seemingly every way U2 does. I mean, you know, um, yeah, yeah. But I mean, you know, they started out. They started out what, like a five-piece or six-piece? I mean, they started out like a, a pretty big band, right? Mm-hmm. No, you know? mm-hmm. no, no, they didn't. They, no, they no, they they they've stayed true. They they had one or two guitar players that they were trying out as they formed. But mm-hmm. this is one band, unlike others who we talk about that have a laundry list of past members these guys you know these larry mullen um adam clayton the edge bono it's been them guys the whole way right but they didn't have what didn't they have um uh whose brother someone's older brother like i think uh the edge's brother was uh was on guitar for a little while oh okay. but i don't know if he was in the band you might be right that they just you know, when, I mean, you know, because it was, 
I guess they they wanted he wanted to call it the Larry Mullen Band, but then Bono came in and he's like, well, I guess I'm not the star of the show. And then what they call himself Feedback or something like that for a little while, and then um, I forget how they how they became U uh, two, but it was like for they were Feedback, then they were the hype, and then they became U two in '78. So yeah, and then it's just been like that, you know. Well, they it it was it was kind of unclear what path they were gonna kind of travel Charles at, mm-hmm. at first the way they came out if they, had, they were gonna go to the punk side and stay there or mm-hmm. they were gonna branch out and do kind of different things too you know there was yeah. well they're interesting Tommy put it in the chat he said they're a peace band the original core members there are four of them but right. like Brendan was saying I remember in the 90s i believe it was i didn't see this but i saw footage of this there were like six guys on stage there was a backup guitar player i don't know if it was his brother or not i think it was his older brother the edges and and there was another guy so i've they've kind of morphed a little as far as what i've seen of them but the real early stuff the 70s the early the late 70s like 76 77 78 79 pretty much six seven years before their first commercial success, which I guess would be hey, 86. Hey, Would that be about right? 87? Yeah. Something like that. Um, it was pretty punky. It was pretty punky. But cool. it was also kind of a little more new wave, I would call it. I would yeah. call it an edgy new wave. But, but in Europe, they were almost techno. They are almost a techno band. Um, yeah, but when they but, morph kind of tech, I mean, I wouldn't call them a techno band, but you go to techno clubs, you'll hear U2 played from time to but, time, you'll hear it, you know. Um, U2 was a band that that was greatly helped with their timing by MTV, yes, yeah, wow. yeah, greatly, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know. Yeah. Um, and Remember Everything. Vertigo, the Vertigo video? Yeah. yeah. That's a pretty badass video, you know. Uh-huh. Every It, it se- seems like that with you 2 every step of their career was a gold mine. Every step along the way, they did exactly as much as they could, you know. I think um, they had really good management. I think they still do. Um, the way they market themselves and media themselves, they are, okay, okay, okay. The thing I don't like about YouTube is how political they are, especially at their concerts. They did a show, um, I believe it was in LA. I wasn't there, but I saw the media coverage and they were, you know, going after America, essentially. They said a lot of things that pissed a lot of people off. And there was a period of time, and I don't remember if it was 92, 93, seemed like it was early 90s. And so they started getting real political. And that was a turnoff for me. I kind of shut myself down to those guys for the better part of a decade. Um, but then, you know, I came back around, kind of like I did with Sammy well, it, <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm joking. A it joke. wasn't exactly your taste of music, let's say, and their stances on certain things didn't help that at all. My negativity towards them was specifically because of how they voiced themselves in a couple of situations that I saw in the media. I literally took what the media said yeah. and let it affect me to the point because they have good music. Their songs are wonderful. They have wonderful messages. They rock live. They really kick ass. Um, are they hard rock, heavy metal? Hell no. But good music is good music, you know. Right. Yeah, it is great music. And um, the it, it, it may not be <laughs> at the time. That. It may not be. I like my rock a little harder back in the 80s you know um i liked 
all the stuff that they did along the way. There, there's not a song that I've ever heard by them that I can say that I do not like. Yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, yeah. Uh, there were just there that there, there was a lot of music out there, and and U2 was just one of them. But they were accepted by the the masses, that's for sure. Yeah, Jay Turner says Gloria. I have literally forgotten about that song, Jay. Completely yeah. hadn't even thought about it until you just said it. And now I'm like, oh wow, yeah. Uh, I, I, I their first, I believe. Yeah, I heard. Well, uh, I heard their label yeah. used their 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 label used MTV to their advantage to to, to oh, yeah. what yeah. how are they going to introduce yeah. them in America? Right. Yeah. You know, yeah. Um, Very cool. So, yeah. Yeah, As you said, Sunday, Charles, good management. Yeah, oh, definitely. You know. uh, Lenny, Lou, and Mary in the chat. We love you guys. Love you guys. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. They do have some good videos. So I've never seen YouTube live. YouTube, YouTube, the YouTube live. <laughs> yeah, me um, either. Had an opportunity at the end of the 80s before I went to Hawaii. Around 89, they did a show. I remember it was a big deal, a real huge big deal. Uh, I didn't go though. I probably would have went to Hawaii instead, also. <laughs> Charles, you know. But... Hawaii was pretty badass. It was. Uh, it was. A, there's a story there. There's a story there. I'll catch you backstage sometime, guys. All right. We'll, we'll talk Hawaii. Now, um, you you two, they they played around here, back on those earlier tours in the arenas around here but i do think that was in the, the 90s there was a, a big outdoor u2 maybe over at carter stadium in raleigh where there was a big outdoor stadium show that they did i, mm -hmm. I didn't go to any of them mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, they played, they played but they everywhere. played a bunch around here yeah um but i recall the last time they it, there was a big, it it was a uh, outdoor stadium. Show. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, they got the hits. They got a lot of back to back, just a string of song after song. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, my, my favorite's uh, New Year's Day. That's my favorite song. From yeah. The, I, earlier stuff. I, you know, I really like that song, Vertigo. I don't know why. Yeah. Um, probably because it's just more upbeat and tempo. Um, they did it live. Oh, I remember why I like it. They did it live at an MTV. I think it was an MTV or it was maybe a New Year's Eve show or something. Um, when it came out, it was it was right there current with it. And it was cool, man. Yeah. It was as rock as they ever were. I remember the show. It was it was very cool. Um, you know, the Edge is a very accomplished guitar player. He's yeah. um, he's incredibly accomplished. Very talented. Oh, he he's unique in the way he plays. Um, not my kind of guitar player, really. You know, you guys know what I like, but. He's so good, and he's so kind. He's such a good songwriter. Um, you got to give those guys their props, man. They're one of the. I think they're probably about as big a band in the world as you could be, which is incredible. So they're on a whole nother level, you know. And they have been. Um, I can remember Paul Marshall. I miss Paul Marshall, by the way. I remember him talking about you two. He was giving some facts one time and just, you know, because he's really good at all those great facts. And uh, he just said that, you know, they're the guys who could call the Queen of England and she'll take their call, yeah. you know, yeah. literally. Yeah. Calls the president. He'll, well, depending yeah, on the were, administrations. They, you know, I swear to probably both administrations would take his call. They they saw, know? they were there. They were at the White House with the uh, Bush administration. That's yeah. right. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. George W. You know? yeah. yeah. He was just trying to elevate his level of cool by hanging around Bono. I don't know if it helped or not. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. But. 
So, so when did you see them again, Brandon? I saw them uh, Joshua Tree tour, late eighties. Oh, Hartford, nice. Hartford Civic Center. And they they had a bunch of hits at that point. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Ben Tom, that's kind of what my stance was too. Um, when they came out, my my favorite guitar players at the time were George Lentz and Eddie Van Halen. That was pretty much my world. And then about nine or ten other guys way before the edge. He wasn't even on my yeah. radar. I grew to appreciate him. That's right. That's right. that's a fact, you know. Um but I had a girlfriend, and she loved you two. Absolutely loved you two. My ex-wife loved you two. They, they. It is weird. I, I, I mean, the edge comes across. I mean, they, they, those songs are written on those, those riffs, and he, he, it, it. On the surface, he looks like the greatest rhythm player to ever live, Charles. You um. Know? You know, it's funny. I, I don't dig the, the tones that he creates so much. That's not my thing, personally. It doesn't mean I'm not knocking him because some people love him. Um, but he uses, I don't, I don't think he uses anything that even equates a straight tone of anything. Uh, it's all very uh, delay and, and effect oriented. Um, but it fits the music. You know, yeah. he, he's a perfect, what he does is a perfect fit for the band. I, I can't imagine Vivian Campbell playing for you too. No. Although it would be worth a listen. I'd listen to it. Sure. Definitely. It's but a total different style. It'd be just a weird fit, right? It wouldn't work. Um, or Ronnie Dio singing for you too. That wouldn't work either. Those guys were made bad. for each other. Uh, oh, yeah. And nobody sounds like you two. Really, I mean, I... I'm sure there's other bands out there, but off the top of my head, I can't think of another single band that sounds like you two. Yeah. Well, maybe, I, I, you know, I think that they they've done really well in, in their career, but when they started, they were very very young, and they stayed they together. Were. They've grown together. They've they've um, become better musicians in time songwriters in time um, oh yeah 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 i mean they're, it's a they're it's the perfect fit you know yes it's very recognizable the songs are recognizable the, their look is recognizable you know it's every, and it's, it's every, interesting um yeah tom's got a good point he fits the role like tom morello fits you know rage and that style of music too so yeah yeah, yeah. It's oh, yeah. absolutely true. I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But they, I, I do think that they, I think they came along at the right time. Yeah. And they came to America at the right time. Right. Yeah, we always talk about that, right? We always talk about the timing. Yeah, and, um, they did. They did have the timing right. You know? Oh, goodness, they did. If they were like 10 years later, I don't know. But they were perfect timing where they were you know yeah yeah yes yeah so awesome awesome sauce i'm uh yeah. i'm looking at a ticket stub so charles <laughs> charles tomorrow is the big day the wasp yes, is. concert is tomorrow we've been talking about it for eight months we have, dude. Eight months. So, so, so Charles is going to see Wasp tomorrow. Who, who's going along, Charles? Uh, well, it was supposed to be you, right? And the chat's flipping out right now, going, "What? What? Can you I'm, feel the tremor? Can you feel it, Brendan? You feel that the tremor in the it. chat? I do feel it. Yeah. It's just like the tremor in the force. Yeah. Um, Who are you taking? My uh, son-in-law, Jacob, is going to go with me, uh, Taylor's husband. Right on. And uh, and we are going to uh, enjoy the hell out of it. Do you want to tell the chat what's up with why? Well, yeah, so so we, 
me and Charles planned this concert like a year ago, and due to, to unforeseen stuff with my left hip that is going to be worked on here soon, um, I'm not going to be able to go tomorrow night with him. I regret. Um, but hopefully he'll he'll get lots of pictures, lots of videos. I'll and, uh, um, yeah, I'm gonna try yeah. out this new. I got a new iPhone, guys, so I'm I'm You're, anticipating getting some good video with good sound. Um, I'm gonna try to get as close as I can. I'm gonna go early. It is sold out. Uh, we will be there early, at least by an hour. And, um, yeah, I, I'm really bummed you're not going, Tony. I am really, the, really, really heartbroken. Uh, but you can bring count back on, a few of these. You can count on some merch and I'll hook you up. You know that. And, uh, I don't mean the merch, I mean the pick. You need a pick. You're talking picks here. Yes, sir. I hear you, man. I'm gonna the do big what I can. score. I'll do what I can, guys. I'll do what I can. I take some lessons from you guys. I watch. I listen. We'll but see what we can do. now, Charles, have a great time tomorrow night, bro. Yeah, yeah we're um, going uh, to enjoy it. I hate I'm not there, man. It has been 36 years since I've seen Wasp. 36 years. Um, wow. And I've been watching some of the shows. You know, as they're coming across the tour, I've watched several full shows, you know, front to back. Um, they're going to play every great song that they know. They're going to do the Idol. They're going to play a couple of songs uh, from the Crimson Idol. And it's going to play Blind in Texas. And it, Wasp wait. hadn't toured America in 10 years. Yeah, 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 yeah. At least. Yeah, so, they're, they're killing it, though. I've seen some people that have seen them on tour already, yeah. and they said they're killing it. Christopher you know? Live Sawa and Dave Z saw them a couple weeks ago. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, Chainsaw Charlie. <laughs> Murders at the Rue Morgue, dude. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. Some of these songs, I've literally songs, I have not heard them live in 35 plus years, 37 years. Um, and they're all songs that I've heard before. So, yeah, this is... Can I damn it, Tony, to I'm bummed you're not going to be there. I'm going to take a bunch of pictures and try my best to get some really cool merch for you. You know that's going to happen. And um, and we'll see. Maybe we can go live from there if we can. We'll see. We're going to just play it by ear. Totally play it by ear. Yeah. Um, we'll see, but, dude. But yeah. You're going to... You, you, Get yourself a little work done here and get yourself ready because we got yeah. a lot of concerts coming up a few months from now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know. But this, this with this, will probably, it'll it'll happen this winter, probably right around New Year. Um, and it'll be a quick thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to it. Um, I already have one on the right side new a couple of years ago mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so but yeah that's just weeks away but yeah yeah this all came up kind of kind of suddenly you guys he uh, yeah. he's been letting me know you know he's been communicating um, and but I've just yeah, been hoping it, you know but it's become it, it's become increasingly impossible to yeah so yeah, yeah um yeah well jake's uh my son law he's a big fan and uh he loves wasp so I, you're good. making his night <laughs> so if it makes you feel any right better on. you guys get right up against the barricade dude. oh yeah we, you know we can take that place over there's no problem but anyway no we're right gonna go and have a really great time um, I don't know how close I'm going to get. I'll be there early. Billmore in Charlotte. Yeah, yes, yeah, sir. it's just 20 minutes away. So, uh, 
Yeah, I'm looking real forward to it. I'll take a lot of pictures, video, the whole nine yards. I'm going to get my wasp on, and um, I'll tell you all about it, man. That's going to be cool, man. Yeah, I can't wait. Cannot wait. Yeah. Um, I wish I was going, Charles. I wish you were too, Tony. But I wish, and I know you're going to have a great time, and I'm excited for you, brother. Yeah can't wait to see 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 the pics and and i've been watching their stuff every show there's always youtube stuff mm -hmm. after the show the days mm -hmm. after so mm -hmm. can't wait dude yeah yeah it's gonna be really cool right on be really yeah cool. but yeah so so we we may in fact early evening tomorrow do something live from wasp at the fillmore in charlotte with charles we'll That's see cool. Um, cool. Yeah. I'm working on it, Ryan, bro. Yeah. Um. Right there, there's him. Or, or, this is what you could do, Charles. I, I could send you a link and not record it or and go live but just you hold hold the phone mm -hmm. and while you're making video you got the window open the stream yard window open and I can mm -hmm. watch the whole show as long as you're videoing oh dude I got you man I can do that I was going to do that shit anyway. I might as well stream it to you while I'm doing it. And if I needed to come in and out, I could. Why does, right. It's a done deal. Hang on as long as It's a done you can. deal. Unless there's some big gorilla telling half me. Half an that, hour an hour. Yeah, dude. Unless there's a big gorilla that tells me I can't, I will be videotaping uh, just for you, Tony. That yeah, makes me happy. Now cool. I've got a mission. I'm on a freaking mission. That's totally cool. Totally you, cool. you just click the link on your phone just like you do on this computer yeah, coming oh in yeah. here. It's the same same thing. You I'm going to hand my phone to Jake and be like, hey, Leave Jake, it. bro, uh, give me a 20-minute break here, brother, and I'll let him hit it. <laughs> we'll see. I don't know how much it, I don't know how much memory this phone has or anything, So it's uh, but it's a new iPhone. It ought, to, it ought to do pretty darn good. There's not a whole lot of stuff on it yet, so. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, it'll be fully charged, Keith. You got that right, brother. You got a new one. The battery will be pretty good for a while. So I'm so impressed. You know, I I have never had an iPhone you're, before. You're gonna love. You're, you're gonna I'm love really the good. video quality. Yeah, it's amazing. You back, the audio, Charles. the video. It's great. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, by the way, I gotta give a shout out to Joe Wentz. He, you know what this guy did? Let me tell you what Joe Wentz did for me. What did he do? I have been struggling to try to be able to produce a guitar tone yes. and send it across the waves to where when you guys listen to it, it's what I'm playing. Yeah. Same tone. Uh, Steve from Boston has accomplished that task. Joe Wentz has accomplished that task. There's a very small number of guys who actually have it correct. I've been complaining about it to Tony for a year. Straight, a year. So he does a video for me. It's about 16 to 18 minutes long. It's on his channel. Only I can watch it. He put it up there just for me. It's my video, which right. sounds selfish, but that was his idea. So I could come and watch it. Yeah. And he not only shows me his entire rig, his entire pedal chain. He tried, now he's using amps and pedals coming into a focus or uh, a, a focus right. Sure. And going into a computer uh, through a um, uh, a mixer. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm a little, my situation is a little bit different. I'm complete computer using bias effects. My situation is a little simpler than what he's got going. Cause I don't have so many pedals and I don't, I'm not hooking up, you know, <laughs> I'm not plugging in 40 things. Right. But his setup is so badass, guys. It is so bad ass. And he goes through, explains to me, not only does he explain to me the setup, he explains to me every pedal. He shows me why the pedal's good, what he has it for. 
he shows me all of his gear and then he takes me through the length of how he winds it all through so he ends up with the tone he has and i gotta tell you what it took time for him to do that for me it answered two questions see i've already got almost all that stuff set up because it's all internal between the focus right that you know that i'm doing everything on the computer so i don't have all that other stuff so it right. simplified big time and he answered a couple of questions that i didn't know the answer to and it's all about routing and if you don't have it right you don't have tone man and so thank you to joe wentz he has hooked me up in a ridiculously awesome fashion and uh, i just wanted to thank him publicly for hooking me up like that next time we've got him in front of me i'm probably going to do the same thing but uh yeah yeah cool. very cool and one of the nicest things anyone's done for me on youtube very cool joe and i appreciate you i just wanted to give him a shout out you guys awesome that was right really on. nice of him to do that for me we'll see we'll see joe wentz if we don't see him before then we'll see joe wentz new year's eve joe's playing right. live yep. on new year's eve right here on fruitcake tony's new year's rocking eve with special live guest joe wentz yeah very cool december 31st 11 p.m eastern cool yeah little ways away but not that Speaking far. Of Joe, Joe will be with us New Year's. Yes, he will. Very cool. Um, yeah. I noticed Sandra in the chat wrote the Vertigo tour became the highest grossing tour of 2005. By the time the entire tour concluded in late 2006, it grossed 389 million, made it the second most successful tour ever. Wow. Mm -hmm. What was the first? Joshua Tree. Is my question. What was I the think, first most successful tour? I think tour? it's the, the GNR Not in This Lifetime tour. Really? Yeah. I would have thought it would have been like Thriller or something like that. Like no, Michael, a Michael no. Jackson tour or something. No. Wow. Wow. <laughs> R2, R3, 199 <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he'd do the same for you, bro, if you needed it. You got it all worked out, too. I know you do, brother. That's funny. Yeah. They, That's awesome, R2. Awesome. Uh, I, I mean, plus, too, Charles, you got to think, unless you were Michael Jackson or Prince, Back in the '90s, it it you know you even headlining bands in the early '90s, you, you know if, if if you were in the middle of nowhere, stopping at a 10,000 seat arena, you know you were lucky for you to take out of the place a hundred thousand, you know, yep. um, usually a hundred and something thousand, you know. Um, I saw it a lot of what these bands made back then now these these tours are yeah 300 million plus 400 million yeah uh -oh. that's ridiculous that but crazy. yeah there's it, with the prices of tickets you know yeah is how it is plus the the fact that um G and R went out there and, and and toured for 2016, 2017, 2018, still calling it the not in this lifetime, and, but they 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 did the business, dude. But yeah. they, they, these the, the biggest tours out there that you're gonna see now are gonna be U2 or the Paul McCartney tour or, you know, um, yeah so i mean if you see queen out there they they draw big yeah they do hey i'll be right back you guys all right pink they floyd do, they draw big crap yeah 
Yes, they do. Yeah, yep. those those guys have have done the business. Those. There's your answer, by the way. Yeah, I see it. Okay, in case the chat was all wondering, I was getting to it. Give me a minute. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. They there's there's a awards that they've won so many times that it's just ridiculous. Oh yeah. You know. Yep. Yeah. Um Yeah. That is cool. Yeah, they yeah. did they did oh they did work on that. I remember that. They worked on that. On the music for the Broadway musical Spider-Man Turn Off the Dark. That thing was like riddled with freaking accidents and stuff, that play. You know, people were always getting hurt on that thing. <laughs> but I heard it was pretty good. I never saw it. Yeah. Um, so I've got a, a poll up on my youtube community page if you yeah. want to click up there there's a poll you cast your vote um yeah nice so of what your favorite youtube song is and then if it's not listed you can certainly leave a comment but yeah before we close that out yeah Yeah. Man, that's cool. I would have to say of that um, list, mine is probably New Year's Day also. Yeah, that's mine. I love that song. Yeah. Screams winter, for, you know? Yeah. Video sure did. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I watched that video and just, you know. You didn't learn that? Did you learn that riff yet, Charles? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> My version's a little more metal than that, bro. Oh, absolutely. It should be. It's time. As it should be. It is time. It is time. It is time. You got to learn that song on <laughs> bass, Charles. Left-handed. Upside down. No, I still think we all have to learn it. We all have to learn it and come in and do a, a riff contest. Upside down. Is that me or the bass? I got to know these things if I'm going to get this right, Tony. You. You well, got one of those hanging oh, things. Those hanging upside down boots, Charles. <laughs> Gravity I bet you, boots. Shit, I bet, over, I bet you could still over, play guys. it. It's over. I would just get one of those exercise things. That oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what they're called. I saw one guy do that. I saw one guy do that. He fell off and his shoes flew off. <laughs> hey, dude, dude. Surprise. <laughs> yeah. Pen <laughs> shot rock and roll trivia yeah, is coming thing. up, Surprise, coming at you. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Holly um, Lewis is in the chat. Hey, yeah. Holly. Love you, hey, sweetheart. What's up, Holly? Let me just show them one more time what we're playing for. We're playing for Eric Clapton pick tonight. What are we That's playing really for, cool. Tony? Let's like check it. Very cool. Says North America, nice. Europe, 2006. Yeah. I'll show you it again under the other one when we get into that. But we're going to give this away to one Told of you us. guys now because we're playing 10 shot rock and roll trivia that we, we are. are coming we are. at you live right now before your naked steaming eyes let's find it someone say naked no Nobody's naked. all righty 10 shot rock and roll trivia for a Clapton pick. Jay Turner won last week. Yes, he did. Yep. Jay's in the chat tonight to defend his. Some of these are easy and some of these are hard, but they are all fun. Yep. And we're playing for a cool prize. 
Uh huh. And good luck. All right. All right. So, so kids, whoever wins, if you're the winner, there's an email address down below in the description here. It says trivia winners email. It's near the top of all the stuff down there. And email me your name and address, and I'll mail you out that Clapton pick on Monday, Lunis. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just, some of these comments are... I know what I'm, you're reading. They're amusing. Yep. All right. Okay. I like amusing. All right. All, All right, right, kids, let's go. Yes, let's play. Are. All right, are you ready to play? Uh -huh. This is for a cool pick, but this is going to be fun as hell tonight. Ten shot rock and roll trivia. Few Ten questions about down. music and rock and roll coming at you now. <laughs> are you guys ready? Brendan is the judge. Now, I understand there's a delay, so your chat order is going to differ from ours. Yep. Uh -huh. Okay. So, uh -huh. we're not going to josh you. We can't you. read that. Trust us. No, um, we won't josh you. We won't. Not at all. We, we got extras. I think I got an extra <coughs> somebody ties. If there's a tired a discrepancy, yeah. We'll figure it out. <laughs> Plenty for everyone. Thanks for being here and thanks for playing. Let's get right into it. Question number one. Here we go. All right. You two has won more of these awards than any other band. Holly. Holly. Holly's in. Holly. All right. Do you want to spotlight right her? Behind her? I am. Yep. Hang on. Sandra, all right. Nice, Holly. Right on, Holly. Grammy. That's for right. For extra credit. For extra credit, do you know how many? Mmm. Oh. Uh, <coughs> and this is, we'll and this is just for Holly. Yeah. Close, Keith. Uh, it's 20 we 22. all know, know the it's answer. 22 i'm gonna say it so we so we can move on but it's 22 okay. 22 yeah wow hundred thousand come on he's close he's close all right holly is on the board with Holly's one on the board. okay we're going to question number two here we go two. complete the next line to this song catch the mist catch the myth catch the mystery I almost hummed it, but I didn't. No, no <laughs> hints for the kid. I didn't. I didn't hum it. I, I tried not to. It was really hard not to, though. Yeah. Uh, Keith, Keith Campbell. Nope. Wait. No? I got Keith Campbell. Oh. What, what you got? Yes, it is right there. Okay. Yep. All right. The drip. All right. <laughs> I guess the spit. Who, who's going to. So, That's what it sounds like. One of you yes, guys, right? Yes. So who? We got all these gonna catches, make... catches, 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 and then R two with. So who's going to make the call over here on each question? Brendan. Who's the judge? Okay. All right. It's, so it's, it's who it's you Keith. see, Brendan. It's Keith. I got Keith. Right. And okay. Sa right. Sandra agreed. So yep, Keith I'm, I'm and labeled. Holly are there with yep. one apiece. Question number three. Yeah. Question number three. Sorry. I like to talk. All right, here we go. Question number three. What was YouTube's YouTube's first music video on MTV? And if you've been paying attention. No, it's, it's not funny time. No, Holly. Keith. 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 Yep. Keith. Right there on. Well played, Keith. Good yep. job, Keith. There we, we go. It was in Sandra's notes. Okay. Nice. So Keith has two. Keith has two. Holly has one. Holly has one. All right. Okay. 
Hey, Gretch Zeppelin. What on, brother? What's up, Greg? Hey, Gretch Zeppelin. You're just in time. We're going to question number four here with 10 Shot Rock and Roll Trivia. Please question please. number four. Good okay. luck. <laughs> Two part question coming up. Uh oh. ID this song and artist in that order. Song need, and artist. Yep, we both. just heard of a brand new way and hope it's here to stay. We'll have to wait and see if it's half of what they say. Song and artist. Everybody's Googling lyrics. <laughs> yes, they are. Oh, oh come on, minute. man. I no, just okay. said it plain. I could have sung it, but... That gives it away. It does. No. Yeah. These are good no. guesses, but no. Holly and Andy. No. That is a good song, Andy. I like the Go-Go's, but no. No, it's we not got the beat. We got the beat. We got the <laughs> beat. Yeah, we got the beat. They're not getting this one, man. I thought they'd be all over it, T. We did do a, a show me your pick with this. We did. Mm. Recently. Mm. Yep. It's all the hints you get. No, it's not Huey Lewis. No. Nope. Cake is not fucking you up. <laughs> hey, He's man, good. I write them like this on purpose, and I say them like that on purpose, right. too. I could have said it in a more revealing way. It is not Beethoven's fifth. <laughs> <laughs> it's very simple if you if you just hum it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't think this but, band ever wrote a band song. Have it, you? you you could have Googled the whole song by now. I mean, shit. Yeah. <laughs> are, are we? I don't have my chat up because I'm in. Well, we're, all the we're questions. getting we're getting there, T. We're getting are, there. Are there any answers? There well, are answers. There are answers. Remember, that we're looking for both the the band, uh, the, the yes, song, yes, and yes. the band. parts to this answer, you guys. There may be yes, some parts. and in that order. Right. Song and then band. 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 <coughs> uh, no. Song then band. <coughs> da, 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 da. Or artist. Uh, yes. Uh, Dan of New Jersey. Did he? Kid is hot tonight. Yes, he Love did. <coughs> well played, brother. Man of New Jersey. Good right. job, buddy. Oops. Is and then Jay go? Turner was right behind him. There we go. Yep. Nice. Yep. Very we nice. We just heard of a brand new way and we hope to. Yeah. <laughs> you guys know that. Come on now. <laughs> you know you About time. But, right. but yeah, T Cake yep. did mess you up. Okay, so what's the score now? The score is. Uh, Holly has one, Keith has two, and Dan of New Jersey has one. Okay. Nice. All nice. right. Plenty of time still, people. Plenty of time. Okay. Plenty Keith time. with two, Holly and Dan. Yep. All right. Question number five. Number five. Coming at you. Number five. Get those fingers poised. You two were inducted into the Hall of Fame in what year? This was in my notes. Dum, 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 dum. It was in my notes. Everybody's going back. Oh, Andy's Andy got person. it. Andy's in. Andy. Andy. Andy, and then Ed right behind him. Tom right behind him. Ryan. Yeah, everybody. Yeah, nice. everybody got it. Yeah. Andy got it first. All right, so Andy is in. Andy's Dan on the with board. one. Holly with one, and Keith yeah. with two. Keith. Keith's got two. All righty. Nice, nice. Good okay. question, Tony. Yeah, they're great. Thank you. All right, going to question six. All right, get ready. Have your thinking caps on, too. Going to question um, six. Nice you two questions. recorded a live album in 1983 at this famous outdoor concert. 
than you. You been there? You been there, You been there? Sandra? Where? Jay Turner. But you've been to what Jay Turner said, Red Rocks? Jay Turner um, got it. Oh, he sure did. Jay Turner. Jay right Turner. there. I've been yeah. by there, but not actually to there. Whack yeah. it. R- Ricky. The Wacken. Wacken. That's Ricky a cool Wacken. festival, too, Sawa. The Wacken Festival. Oh, my God. Yeah. Germany. It's all metal. All metal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so right. it, it it's become a little bit of a close horse race. Oh, yeah, man. Jay's on the board with one. Holly's on the board with one. Dan's on the board with one. Yeah. And Keith Andy. is on. And yeah. Andy's got Andy's one. Andy's got one, and Keith has two. So four have one, and yep. Keith has two. Yep. All right, guys. It, but it's still, if, if you don't have any yet, it's still anyone's yeah, game. Yeah, it's still up in the air. Okay, so. Number seven. Number seven coming at you. Here we coming go. At you. Coming at you. Little cha- change of subject matter here. All right. Ten shot yep. rock and roll trivia number seven coming at you. Sandy West was the drummer for this band. Come on, guys. <laughs> Google. Where you at? Tom's no, mom. No, no Google. You mom. should know this right off the bat. No, it's it's not the Partridge family. Jeff K. Yep. Je- right Jeff there. Jeff K. The Runaways. Nice job. Wow, it's 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 uh, hey, it's definitely, Papa. definitely a horse race. Hey, Papa, Papa Blue. Where the hell are we going? Right there. Mr. Mr. Yeah, good to see you, bro. Nice to see you, too. Mr. 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 Rock. Mr. Rock, good to see you, dude. Yeah, okay. I like Mr. Mr. What's our if score? Just, yeah. Our score is Keith 2, everybody else 1. Okay. <laughs> <So> <laughs> Holly, Dan, Andy, Jay... And uh, Jeff K. I'll have one. Hey, Nelson. All right. What's hey, Nelson? Nelson. What's up, bro? Charles, you're muted. There you Thank go. Thank you. I don't know how long there you were you muted. Go. I just happened to look down and notice. It's number... all good. Thank you. Thank you. Where are we at? Number eight? Number eight. Oh, yeah, we're going to number eight. Number eight. All right. Number eight. So, all right. <clears throat> we, me, we me, all me, 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 me. <laughs> you, you, you. As Quentin would say. All right, number eight. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Type the next line to this song. Sweet revenge, the bitter end, this time. Break the spell of illusion. Bound together. <laughs> Come on. Type it in the search box. No. Nope. You know you know it. It's not by confusion. No. Just type the next, not the title or the artist. Just type the next line to next the line. song. Nope and nope. Yep, nope, nope. <laughs> I'm gonna wave it. I'm gonna wave it to him like a steak. Yeah, man. <laughs> you want that pick, don't you? You want that oh. pick, don't you? Ben, ben Tom, I believe. Where did it go? Uh, yeah. um, yeah, it's in there. I would, I would say, right. He, it's included in there. Yeah. Yep. There Good it job, is. Tommy. Job, yeah, Tommy. nice. Right on. right on, Tommy. So that is the the that's Dream Warriors. Thank you, Sandra. From I didn't even see it because I was looking at Bound Together. You know, <laughs> Dream yeah. Warriors. 
two chants here, and I saw it, and then I lost it because everybody else got it. The chant <laughs> Holly did get the song, but we wanted the the, the lyrics. We wanted the next line, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Holly right was on. Getting your ass off. <laughs> yeah. 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 Type the next line to this. Song. Like All right. That's good. Okay, so we got it's still anyone's game with two left. Yeah. Two left. Anybody, and anybody there's can six tie up with Keith. one and Keith has two. It's anybody's game. I know really, folks. All right, so number yeah. nine, we're getting close. Number nine. And this is basic as you can get if you're a rock fan and you don't know this. For shame. Shame on you. Janice joining the chat. Hey, Janice. Oops. I had her. Hey, Janice. We're going to question number nine in 10 <laughs> shot rock and roll trivia. It's still anyone's game. A lot. There's two to one to one to one to one to one. A six man just throwing one. Out. They're just throwing out answers now. Oh, okay. You guys stink. Yeah, they're just guessing. I don't even know the question. No, All right. that's not the answer. I know everybody in the chat is a rock fan. Um, and but I know they, they know they're rock too. And this is as easy a question if you're a rock fan, but. <laughs> Ramstein. <laughs> so, with that said. That's funny. <clears throat> Are there any Sammy Hagar fans in here tonight? I'm sure there might be a couple. This has nothing to do with the questions. He's just asking. Yeah, I'm just asking. So if you're a, a, a <laughs> if you're a Sammy Hagar fan, type in "I'm a fan." <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes is not the answer to the question. Charles, are you muted again? Is he no, muted he's again? Not. Huh? No? I, I blame you. Sammy. That's all I'm saying. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look, they're still just typing shit in. I know. All right. <laughs> he says, okay. come on, come on, come on, come on. All right. So number nine. <laughs> number Get nine. ready to type. Here we go. What is the name of the new album from Sammy Hagar in the Circle? Basic rock knowledge. Basic. Yeah. It's not standing Hampton. Keith Campbell. Yep. Keith is Campbell right? is in with three. There, there so, we go. Uh, I think Keith Campbell is our winner. Keith I Campbell by default get is the winner. But we will ask the last question, which is kind of good, Tony, because the last question is a tough one. The last question. Right? So, yeah. So, as we stand... On the score, Keith has three. Yes, Keith. Has and who three. has one? Everybody else. <laughs> Holly, <laughs> Dan, Andy Carson, Jay Turner, Jeff K, and Bent Tom. They all have one. Okay, with one left. Keith left you dudes in the dust. I'm sorry. Yep. He did. He... Pew. That should be our intro music for the show. Do that again, Brendan. So, good luck, and you know what we do around here on question number 10, usually, we give you a know the show. So, that's what you're getting for question number 10, again, this week, you might get it next week, too. Yeah. Yeah, Andy, Keith took a power nap. You're it absolutely did. right. It worked, though. It worked. <laughs> All right. So for question 10, yeah. we're going to give you something like <clears throat> this. What is the name of the lake where Brendan's Sub-Zero Heroes Ice Jump takes place? You can't even Google that. Oh, you probably no, you can't Google this stuff, dude. That's some gourmet shit. It is. Yes, it is. <laughs> Love that. I don't like where this is going. No, it's nope. not Lamb. No, not Lake Michigan. Nope. Are you nuts? Not Poughkeepsie. Right now. No, Poughkeepsie. Lake Michigan. Right now. It's not even in Poughkeepsie. 
Like, no. Mm. No. No. No, it's not that one. No, not that one either. No, no not that Might one. Might as well be called that, Boomster Black. No, not that one. No, no not that one. Jesus. Loch Ness. Hey. Like Walters? No. Bob Slade. <laughs> Emerson, Lake, and Palmer? No. <laughs> That's a good one. Lake Old Pines. That's a good one. If Frozen. <laughs> no, so we've talked about God, the name. The <laughs> Tom got it. Tom got it. Nice, Tom. Nice, Tommy. Oh, he did. He did. He yeah. did. Right, right there. Yes, oh, he Tommy. did. Wow, Come on, buddy. Right on. Yes, it is Barrion Lake. Barrion yep. Lake. And we Cold talked about Lake. that recently here on the channel the name of the lake specifically a yeah. couple of times so yeah, shrinkage lake tommy was yeah <laughs> i was gonna call it lake shrivel up there. lake shrinkage lake shrinkage keith and tommy good. tied two two now or is keith still win keith won oh, keith, okay. got, yeah. keith got three so keith campbell is the is the trivia winner for tonight good yeah. job guys well yeah dude nice. Good job, right everyone. on, Keith. You did yeah, it, Tom, dude. Good, good job, Tom. Runner up. That's and a good game here. from everybody. That was Listen, everybody. Where question: If Brendan, you want to say, oh, wow. say what's that? Where do they go if they want to know more about Sub Zero? Here? Oh, there, there should be. Did, did, is there a link in the chat? Is there a link in the description? Because there might have been. Know. We're gonna uh, start. If there isn't, there that. will be. I did yeah, check it last be. time, and it, I think it did hey, work. Hey. If not, I'll put one in there. Um, yeah. But yeah, so we'll put a link in there, and uh, it'll take you to take you to the donation page where you can support me jumping. Um, it's February twenty fifth. We jump between eleven thirty and noon, closer to noon. And uh, don't. Yeah. I, I won't be wearing that. But. <laughs> but. Uh, I, I did used to have a blow up turtle, but it deflated. And oh man! Air you like the water. I I think you like the water. You I you're do. in the water here too. I'm in the water all the time. I like the water. You know, I, I go to the beach. They keep trying to push me back in the water. I'm just kidding. It's horrible. Um, no, I do like the water. I'm a lake guy. Pools are nice too. I'm not really an ocean guy, but I like I like lakes. I like pools. I used to just go out into the ocean and bob around on a surfboard or no surfboard and didn't even care until I saw that movie Jaws. Yeah, man. And within about two years after that, yeah. I was out on my board with a bunch of my friends and a hammerhead shark swam underneath us. Yeah. And even though it was really only maybe eight feet long, it Thank looked like it was 12 to 15 feet long because, you know, they look bigger in the, under the water. And I swear that was the end of my little... Uh, surfing experience Life man it surfing. literally yeah. changed everything it was really so, weird yeah so Sandra put the link in there when you click on that link it'll bring you to the page you can scroll down and donate to a participant and then you just put my name in there and click go and it, and you can you can you remain can, anonymous you can type in any right. amount so, yeah. yeah yeah and uh, um, speak a little bit Brendan about where this donation is going and what so, this money is used for so yeah so this this donation will go to to fund uh, aware research and awareness and programs for uh, caregivers and patients of Alzheimer's people that that have contracted the disease uh, and their caregivers uh, so we can give them all the information they need to fight this disease and um, you know get their loved one as comfortable as they can because it's horrible um, Thank you. There, there is no cure right now but there is there are ways to make it easier and uh, they're they're working hard to uh, to get some drugs that you know may slow the progression mm -hmm. so, nice to right, see you Andy, Andy. Thank you, Andy. well brother so so yeah I mean we've we've been doing this for oh more than 10 years this is probably i think this is the 12th or 13th year we're doing it 
and it's just it's it's one of one of the things I, I love most you know about the winter I love winter anyway um, but just doing this ma makes me happy um, makes me feel feel good and hopefully it, it makes others feel good and, and brings some sort of calm and uh, uh, just some some awareness really because I mean I know a lot of people know this disease and probably have had people in their family friends or you you, you pretty much know somebody you can, you can throw a rock and hit somebody that you know that has it or has been affected by it and mm -hmm. it's just it's terrible so um, yeah but but again like I said if I can do anything to help it out I will um, so that's that's why I do this that's why my wife and I do this um, she's been working for the association for over 22 years so she, you know and uh, she uh, she helps caregivers with programs and services tells them I'm how gonna to grab some tea real quick I'll be okay. right back guys how to deal with uh, with everything find resources in their area and uh, it's nationwide so um, you can always email me send me an, a DM email me and we can always help if you don't want to say anything here that's that's fine I know it's a very personal disease but We'll be able to to direct you to your local local chapter and local office and get the help that you need. Um, so yeah, so thanks everybody that's donated and will donate and we'll be doing a live stream like we did last year. It'll be fun. I'll be, be cold. Yep. <laughs> but I don't care. So <laughs> and we will we'll, we we will have a giveaway. We will have a a contest. So um, still thinking about it. It's not going to be a guitar this year, but it'll be something, something good. So excellent. Dude. So yeah. So thanks in advance to everybody. Yeah. Appreciate it. Yeah. I know I'm, thank, I stumble and you, mumble. Thank <laughs> yeah. you, Brendan. I know I stumble and mumble about this stuff, but I should just get my wife down here. She has, I'm sure she has a statement already made. You know, <laughs> tailor made for it because she talks about it all the time. We speak but, from the heart, and there's nothing wrong with it. Yeah. No, it's 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 very close to me. You know, so I love doing it. It's it's a great cause, and hopefully yeah. one day, hopefully one day, she'll work herself out of a job. You know, that would be yeah, that would be fine. Yeah, you know, if all of a sudden they found a cure and she didn't have to, she didn't have a job, that's okay. Be you know, it's worth it. She's such a sweetheart. She just find another cause to support. Oh yeah, yep. So. My audio okay, guys? You're back, yep. sir. All right. You are back. I know when I change camera views, I get muted yep. sometime. But this is this is Keith's right here. This is going out to you, Keith. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, so that's going to Keith. Let me show you guys some. Um, let me get into another view. We'll show you some YouTube pics tonight. Nice. Um, so, like I said earlier, I've got eight new guitar pick videos up on the shelf or up on the on the channel that were just uploaded yesterday. Cool. So, and there's different ones. There's hard rock, there's Van Halen, there's country. Something for everybody. But all the guitar picks that have been accumulating for the past six months um, were all videoed out and put in the collection and in their proper, you know. Cool. Yeah, I'll keep that one. <laughs> so maybe that one. All right. That one's cool. Nice. 
know. Better not. Um, here's another one from this tour. Is that Bonner? Yeah. Um, and that, that's another one just like the other. And this is, let's see here. Yeah, Joshua Tree Tour, 2017. 2017. Yeah, it's kind of a clear. That is clear. And then there's this one. And this one is probably the rarest of the bunch, but this yeah. is from the Super Bowl. Well, that was oh, a wow. freaking great Super Bowl halftime show. Yeah. Um. Hey, can we go back to that 2017 thing? I saw Jay even put a question mark up, and I have had a question mark in my head. When did Joshua Tree? Yeah, that was in the eighties. Yeah, it was that's the, the tour uh, 80, I saw. 88, 89 or something like that. Maybe oh, it's uh, Joshua Tree thirty, so it's a thirty yeah, anniversary. Yeah, it's the anniversary. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, it's a commemorative. Yeah, yeah, dedicated. Okay, yeah, well, no, that makes I said sense. The, I said the same thing, Jay. I was like twenty seventeen. <laughs> Wait, I saw that so, tour eighty seven. So these picks right here, they have one for each member not for Adam, Larry of Adam course. Yeah. Yeah. But th this is the only Super Bowl that that's I've cool, got. Man. Yeah. That, that's got to be a rare one. Yeah, you don't I I don't notice them much. Let me get out of here. I don't notice them much. You got to mute and unmute, bud. One more time. Nope. One more. All right. Third time's a charm. Yeah. Always. You got it. Always. You got it. Hey, Tony, Jay sent me uh, his ticket stub from U2 in, U2 in Las Vegas. 87, right? Yeah. Yeah. Show it. Nice. Oh, nice. Very cool. very cool, dude. When cool. was that? Oh. It disappeared on me. Oh, my goodness. Uh, he paid 16 bucks. Oh, my God. Wow. Those days are gone, brother. Yeah, man. Um, yeah, they are. I don't see it on the ticket. I think it was 87. Yeah, 87 makes sense to me. That's yeah. when I would assume it would be. Uh, for some reason, I was thinking 88, but I know it was the end of the 80s. Uh, but that's badass, man. <laughs> that is cool. That is cool. That's hey guys, that's, you gotta check out Mean Street, man. Van Halen cover band. Yeah, they're good. Jay's the bass player, and uh, these guys rock, man. They rock, absolutely rock. I can't wait to see them play. Me and Tony are gonna go to a show, and it's gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah, they've got one in May. Charles. Yeah, how's the timing uh, sound for that, Tony? For you, sounds what do you think? perfect. Sounds you, perfect. Nice. Here you guys. Nice. Very let nice. Me, uh, let me get out of here with you. Sorry. If it was any earlier, Tony would be. Uh... I'm falling. And I can't get up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. Nah. We don't want that. No. Nah. We joke, but we love you, T. We know you're gonna. I, you that. know. Great. I tried. No, I'll. I'll bounce quick on this one. Yeah. I've already had one new hip already, right. so don't forget. You know, I, I told Tony, you guys, I'll share this with the chat. I told Tony, I said, Tony, we can get a wheelchair. I'll put you in it. And I'll take you to that show. Oh, dude, you'll get great seats. You'll have great seats. We talked about all of this. But 
you know, they'll put them up on the... You know, and I understand. I understand, man. But you put uh, them up on stage. You get the wheelchair going across. Dude. dude. Crowd surfing in the wheelchair. <laughs> Tony V. Ah! We'd have made it work, man. We'd have made uh, it I work. Think, I think I see a picture from Ed coming of Tony in a wheelchair crowd surfing. That's so funny so. you said that. I thought about <laughs> that too, Brendan. <laughs> <laughs> well, but it, you know that this venue is standing room only at the Oh, and it's sold out. But that aside, I I, I did I, I I know somebody here locally that that has a, a shuttle ser- a, a limousine service. Oh, nice! And um, mm-hmm. I asked him, and but it was just a little pricey, and I I don't know how it helpful that would end up actually helping anyway, you know. Um, yeah. But yeah. still, though, I, I'd love to be there tomorrow night, Charles. Well, um, we're going to, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to send you a, a lot of video footage and you'll be able to watch it in real time. That'd be cool. Uh, with me and Jake screaming and talking a lot of shit, it'll be wonderful. <laughs> well, it, I hope we can, yeah, it, if, um, I, I, I'd like to watch it live in real time. Yeah, if you're going to be holding that thing up, videoing, you might as well have another window open with me in it. Yeah. That's exactly what I'm thinking, too, Tony. It'll be good, man. It'll be good. No, I'm actually excited for you. That's going to be cool. Yeah, for man. You. I'd love to watch cool. it no, like I'm that. Gonna, I'm going to videotape the thing I'm anyway. I'm excited for you, dude. Oh, dude. That's awesome. That's cool. Uh, Holly, uh, just... That poster right there is the Alex Van Halen poster next to your Tinkerman that was right here. I'm just moving some things around. I don't know if you notice, I cleaned off a bunch of stuff up there and a bunch of stuff under there. And there's going to be a lot of changes going on. My daughter's last Christmas, the Christmas gift they gave me was to turn this room into a YouTube friendly studio, utilizing another computer and making it happen. And we've been real busy this year and they haven't, made it happen yet but they mentioned it to me the other day and so we're moving forward with that and uh anyway um you'll see some changes but holly that picture is the alex van halen one that was just right here i just moved it and i've got um a couple other ones that i'm going to be hanging uh i even uh you know uh perry he sent us um uh those eight by ten glossies and so uh i'm going to frame one of those as well um, fill up some wall space, you know. Let me, um, I almost forgot. I'm going to go back to this other camera angle. I want to show you guys this. Okay. I've got to show you these two new ones. One of them is kind of special here. I'll explain. All right. So let me show you these new things. Oh, wow. Dude, an international yeah. warrant guitar pick? That's cool. I've never seen one. I've never seen an international warrant pick before. That's pretty cool, man. That is very cool. Oh, that's great, dude. That is very cool. All right, so now a couple of things about this pick Alice mm. Cooper. now we've all seen the these are Grover all almond picks mm-hmm. now we've all seen the let me get one out here to show you guys by comparison that's not it Yeah, I do. I think. Crap. Anyway, let me. All right, so. You know the ridges on the Dunlop 
max grips. Yeah. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah. Look at the grips on this thing. That's cool. It's like stippled, like a golf ball. I mean, it is beyond grippy. That's cool. I like that. But I don't know if you guys know who's back in Alice Cooper. Kane Roberts. Nice. Yep. Yeah, Nita so Strauss at, uh, moved on to play with Demi Lovato, actually. You know? Hmm. This, cool. this thing is beyond grippy. I mean... You yeah. could have a nice Thanksgiving dinner and then not even wash your hands and go play guitar. You'd be fine. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Like, like gravy and shit all over your fingers. Like, I don't cranberry care. cranberry sauce. Yeah, man. It's just cranberry sauce. You just hold it back. Oh, it's messed up. So, <laughs> I don't know if you guys remember this or know this, and those of you in the chat, um, Kane Roberts who plays guitar for Alice Cooper now and was in Alice Cooper back in the 80s, yeah. in the late 80s. He, he was on the communication breakdown with mm. Sandra and Gary wow, a couple that. of years ago. Yep. And <laughs> it's a great show. It's up on her channel. That's and the cool. link is down below if you want to check it out. But, can't, yeah, um, I was... Lucky enough, Sandra invited me to come backstage, and I got to go backstage and, and meet Kane before their communication breakdown show. That was great. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Excellent. Excellent. Awesome. Yeah. Aw, you know I'm listening to all this. <laughs> yes. Yeah, Kane, Kane's a... He's a interesting character. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Fun so night. maybe since we haven't done an Alice Cooper episode here on Show Me Your Pick, and I got a few Alice Cooper picks. He's had a few players of he he's got a big list of players, cats that have played with him. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh yeah. And, uh, yeah. Um, but yeah, so so I don't know. Never know what can happen around here on Show Me Your Pick. No, you don't. Yikes. <laughs> but these picks are bad, and if you watch any of the latest Alice Cooper stuff, you can see Kane in action. And he does look a lot like he did back in the day, Sandra. Oh, yeah. he's <laughs> He doesn't stop at the gym. I mean, he's, he's always there. Always. Yeah. If you follow him on Facebook, his selfies are usually even going to the gym or coming from the gym or something to do with the gym. Yeah. And then, and then uh, at his shows with Al is right now, but he's got, uh, he put out an album, I think, last year or the year before, and it's, it's uh, pretty good. I forget the name of it, but check it out if, if you get a minute. His solo stuff is, you're muted, Tony. Yes, you are. He's talking up a storm, too. Okay. Still muted. He'll be back. Yeah. How about now? Yep. Yeah. Good. So, but that show with Kane Roberts is up on Sandra's channel. Um, oh, it's private. They can't see it. Yeah. Oh, it's private. All my live shows are. Okay. <laughs> well, scratch that then. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <clears throat> if you ask me nicely, I might send to someone a link to oh, there you watch go. it, but yeah. There you go. Okay, now. Nice. All right. Right now, Lisa Belander is the only one with a link to that, to my, my live shows, because she's trying to, she's watching them. Yeah. So just let her take her sweet time, and then when she's done with that, we'll we'll see. Mm -hmm. She sent me. She sent me a nice uh, 
message the other day about um, the amp that I built Gary. So she's yeah. she's she's gonna keep it. She says she loves that thing. So I'm glad. So, yeah, cool. she told me that watching some of those old shows with, with him and I are helping her get through. Yeah. But yeah. I tried to tell him to get more shit on his channel, but he just wouldn't listen. <laughs> <laughs> R2, is that what the name of this is called, Grippy Pick? If it's it, a Grover Almond Pick. Um, if it isn't, it is now. And they make nice picks over there. How about this one, Keith? <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> Lovely, Sandra. I'll be right back. <laughs> uh, yeah, some good ones. I'm going to go. <laughs> Where are you going? I'm going to go put some drops in my eyes. Okay. Take some aspirin and some lay down. Okay. Okay. Did we get through everything, TK? We're getting there. Have you got to go, babe? I'm thinking about it, yeah. All right. Love you, sweetheart. Feel better, Love sweetie. You. Feel better. You guys, too. Yeah. See my eye chat? <laughs> oh, right there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Some drops in there. Compared to this one? Put some ice on it. I put the warm compresses on it. Yeah. yeah. That my eyes. Is, is it Tylenol. You will, sweetheart. Yeah. Yes. Then I get to constantly pull crap out of it. All that fun stuff. Good stuff. No, yeah. Well. Yeah. There we go. I can never yeah. make it. Is why I never do it. I always do something. <laughs> Mine's always. It doesn't look like a heart. I make a kidney or a liver or something. <laughs> That's an organ. Just make a perfect circle, Tony. It's all good. There you go. All right. <sighs> she all got right. It. I'll try. That's it. It's not bad. Hey. At a glance, you got it going on, brother. It's, it's more anatomically correct. Maybe it's upside correct down. Than, it's more anatomically correct than these. You know? Oh, you do it like that. Okay. Hey, yeah. I, I'm doing it. Yeah, there it is. Like nice, nice. Success! Nice. Yes. I can never do that shit, man. That's I always okay. did it like this. Everybody's like, what the? That's not right. bad. Well, that actually <laughs> looks more like a heart. Yeah. That's yeah. what I said. That did. It's anatomically yeah. correct. But yeah. At an angle? It's like a glob. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Hey man, as long as it's beat. When I look at it this way, it looks like a heart. Yeah. I can't, I can't turn my hands around. The harder rock. Anyway, okay. I'm gonna go for real now. Okay. I go now. All right. Be well, sweetheart. We'll see you. See you later. In the words of Jay Hannon. Bye. Bye. Oh. Bye. Speaking of the Hannons, anyone heard anything on Ellie or what, any any word? Um, I've seen a couple of pictures and she's she's recovering. Okay. I, I'm not sure if she's still in the hospital. Last I knew she was. Okay. So I don't know if they celebrated Thanksgiving in the hospital or not, but um, she's still on the mend, which is great. Okay. Um, so I, I sent him a little, a little text, and he just put a like on it. So I'm sure they're real busy still, you know, yeah. taking care. So. Okay. Okay. Yeah, they'll, I'm sure there'll be an update soon. Um, he he was mentioning that he he will be making some sort of you know, statement about it when he, okay. when he gets back on his show. Okay. Or some some way in social media, but yeah. So I think she's uh I think she's doing a lot better. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. Hi Ellie. Good. Yeah. yeah hi, Good Ellie. vibes and prayers go out to the Hannon family. Absolutely. Um Yeah. And yep. so yeah, waiting yep. to hear good news. Yep. Yeah. From them. Yep. Yeah. Um, 
Yeah. Hope hey guys, I've got, a, I've got a couple of 120-pound uh, dogs that I need to take outside. They're literally scraping at the door. <laughs> Yeah, don't, don't let them beat the door on um, I hate to cut my show short. Uh, are we just about to wrap up, you guys? Or we're, we're, Go walk your dogs, and we'll probably be almost wrapped up. All good. Hey, if I don't see you guys again, I love you all. Yep. I'll let you know. Wasp, we're rocking tomorrow, you guys. Yeah, right. dude. And, Tony, I'll be calling you. All right, brother. See you later. See you. Good to see you guys. Love you. Love you guys. Love you. Love you, Charlie. All right. And then there were two. He, he might pop back in. He may. He might get done early. Um, maybe, maybe not. Yeah. Um. So we could very well be going live tomorrow here on the channel. That'd be from cool. From Fillmore in Charlotte with Charles at Wasp. Nice. Um. We'll yeah, so time. so you got a show upcoming next week, brother. Yeah, next next Saturday I won't be here because I'll be at uh, Steel Panther. Right on. They're playing. That's going to be awesome. I've seen yeah, them once dude. before. It's a great show. So. Yes, it is. So yeah, I'm gonna be going. I'm gonna be going with a, a coworker of mine. I actually, when I bought tickets, it was it was cool. When I bought tickets, it, it was um, you you get four for the price of one. So, I'm gonna find a couple more people at work that want to go. I only I paid for one ticket and they gave me four. Well, I so. thought you'd take Meg. She, I asked her, but I don't know if, <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't know if I'm kidding. Go. You know, though she she's she's a trooper that way. She's not a huge metal he, metalhead, but um, way back when we went with a couple to see Disturbed, like when they were first starting to play. Yeah, that was an amazing show. And well, she, actually, I, she had a good time. Only reason I say is um, Steel Panther may not be the best choice of shows <laughs> to take your wife to. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, she, yeah. They they do uh, uh, a lot of... Uh, you take your wife to bad question. company. Yeah. They do a lot of questionable things. <laughs> yeah. So, But yes, bad company. Now you take them... Take your wife to Rush. That's what you do. So you take your wife to Steel Panther, and you ask her why she's wearing a bikini under all her clothes. Right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, no it's a good it show, is. Though. So I'll be there, I'll be there next Saturday. So I'll I'll probably pop in the show at some point. Yeah. Cool. Bit. Is so. there any opener? There usually is. Um, let me see if I can find out because it's all it's uh, I think the name of the show is like Paws and Claws or something like that or Claws and Paws or some weird thing like that it's so weird let's see, let's see. Paws and Claws is that the name of the opening act? Claws and Paws no that's the name of, it's a holiday party so yeah there's two there's actually two openers small town titans and jaded so I've, I've never heard of those bands but that's the that's the name of the there's two openers and then them so doors open at 6 30 they probably won't go on till probably 10 you know yeah. there's two two open right so it'll be right in the middle so you know i'll, I'll probably pop in one or one or two times real quick so again, Brendan, we're, we're going to start posting these links in these shows yes. as we approach years in and in end of new year. Your sub zero here as ice jump is when again? February twenty fifth. It's a Saturday, and we jump around around noon, just before noon. So yeah, so yeah. So we'll probably go live like eleven thirty, um, and I'll have someone hold the phone. Like last time when I jumped in, and then I'll grab it and go change. Uh, yeah. And then talk to you guys again once I can feel my fingers and toes. Um, so. Now, we'll explain the donations and the levels once yes. we 
get into the meat of the season with yeah. this, but um, the the Alzheimer's Association in general is a wonderful thing. Yeah. Um, Great organization. It, my people have been involved in, in it for a long time. Yours have been involved in it um, in many levels for a long time. You yeah. and Meg. Yeah. Um, so it, yeah. it's a wonderful cause, and, and these dollars, they, they do, they go directly to research and the caregivers, and they very much matter. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Yep. Yeah, they stay, and, and a lot of it stays in the area in your chapter, so if you donate in your area, a lot of it does stay. I don't know the exact percentage, but a lot stays local, and then, you know, there's some that goes national. So yeah, their national headquarters is in Chicago, um, but like I said, they have they have branches, they have field offices, and in every state, in every county, in every state is is represented. So yeah, it's very right. it's 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 nationwide, and it's a great organization. So yeah, yeah, um, yeah, but that'll be coming up, and we'll yeah. cover that live here on the channel, Brendan. Yeah, looking fun. forward to that. That that was great fun last year. Oh yeah, and we look forward to you and Meg speaking more about this in mm -hmm. in the weeks to come. Yeah, I'll have as her come down and make. I'll have her come down and make a good. I mean, she's she does this stuff for a living, so she's got all kinds of information, and she can uh, articulate it a lot better than I do. <laughs> so we'll have her down here again. So. Yeah. Some, one of the, you know, maybe after the new year. Yeah. Or maybe on New Year's. Who knows? You know, I don't know. So we'll right. see. Right. Yeah. Um, hey, speaking of New Year's, now that we're yeah. we're really into the holiday season, you got Black Friday, and then you got what? Small Business Saturday, Secondhand Sunday, Cyber Monday. Yep. What's the day after that? Uh, I don't know. I'm sure there are other days. I know. But, but uh, now that we're into the holiday season. Fruitcake Tuesday? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we are getting into the season of the fruitcake, though. Yes, we are. That you mention it. But as we approach the holiday season, looking forward to... New Year's with Fruitcake Tony's New Year's Rockin' Eve. With special guest Joe Wentz from yes, the Joe Wentz awesome. Project TV right here. Live, playing live for us on New Year's. Yeah. Yep. That's going to be good. And it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. So that is New Year's. Mark your calendar. That show is already built on YouTube. You can click the reminder, and it'll notify you we're going live at 11 o'clock Eastern oh. on New Year's Eve, and nice. we'll cover all four time zones. So that means for us East Coast dudes, 3 a.m. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to take a nap that day. I am fully <laughs> aware that I may be riding solo at the helm at the end of the night. <laughs> I will try my damnedest to stay awake. So, But that is New Year's Eve right yep. here. Saturday night, December 31st. Mark your calendars. Yeah, R2. Joe, Wal Joe Walsh is playing R2. Funny guy. <laughs> Joe Wentz. Yep. Yeah. Um... And he might bring Rob with him, too, from Rob's Music Store. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I'd like to see Rob every once in a while, too. Sure. Yeah, dude. Yeah, I hope everybody shows up. You know, all you guys in the chat, hang out with us. We'll have a good time. Yeah. We will be might be imbibing a little bit. There'll be snacks. You know? Yeah. 
Um, so let me let me share with the kids a little bit about what's happening here on the channel sooner than that next week here on show me your pick so first of all let me say that if any anybody if any of you guys like a custom guitar pick we have a fella who makes ours at Legend Picks named Greg, and he yep. makes picks for all these artists. Mm -hmm. And he can make picks for you too. His links are in the description. And yeah, he does great work. He's a great guy. Yep. Greg from Legend Picks and Speaking of Greg from Legend Picks, next week, right here on Show Me Your Pick, Kansas, nice. with special guest Greg Collins from Legend Picks, right nice. here, Saturday, December 3rd, next Saturday night. And it's Tommy's birthday. Ben Tom's birthday. Right on. Nice. We'll bring a cake, Tom. What kind yeah, of cake we you will. Like? But Greg Collins will be yeah, joining awesome. us next Saturday night. Very cool. Right yeah, here on Show Me Your Pick as I've we talk some. about Kansas and got show it. you a bunch of Kansas picks and stuff cool. through the years. Coolness. Yeah. yeah. Um, yes. So what do you got coming up Wednesday? Wednesday. Ooh. Oh, I know you got something good it. coming up Wednesday. So Wednesday, Wednesday around here, we talk about Van Halen on Halenville Live yeah. every Wednesday, 9 p.m. Eastern. And this Wednesday on the show, where is it at? Let's find it. There it is. Nice. Simon Hosford, Very our cool. special guest this Wednesday. Yeah. Nice. So Simon is just coming off the road. He's done a lot of a lot of touring, a lot of gigging, and we'll catch up with him this Wednesday. Good deal. And thanks to Ed Debril for this great thumbnail. Yep. That's cool. Of the whiskey, and if you look down at the lower left. Look down at the I lower think I see left. Charles Who down do you there. see? I see you Charles, see Charles at the door. Green. Yep. That's look at that. That's great. Working the door at the whiskey. Of course. Of course. Yeah. But that's this Wednesday. Halenville Live. Yep. Yeah. It's Simon Hosford. Yeah. And good stuff. Yeah, good stuff. New contest over there on the Wednesday show. A lot of exciting things happening over there. A lot of cool guests lined up for you. Coming at you this year, 2023, this new year. Oh, man. Yeah, it's going to be a good it's one. It's coming. Show me your pick guest. Coming. It's going to be a Halenville good Halenville Live Comp. Yeah, dudes. Um, looking good for the new year. Very excited. A lot of stuff happening. Um, yep. Yeah. I wish I could tell you all about all of it now, but. Uh, you just have to show up. You have to yeah. show up each week and find out. Yeah. That's but we will go ahead and tell them about this contest that we're running on Wednesday on Halenville we'll mm -hmm. call it the Halenville Live Lost Year End Contest 2022 cool. look at that well we're going to take four trivia winners all four from the month of December nice and that? we're going to invite thumbnail? them was that thumbnail there were you fighting Hall and Oates what was that <laughs> that's funny oh man but that 
we're going to take the four winners from December okay. and invite yeah. them back on the 30th to a private all-inclusive wow. backstage bash. Nice. We'll have trivia at this party for some really nice prizes. That's um, awesome. We'll have all our stuff. You'll get koozies and, and passes and picks and other kind of passes and and posters. There'll be some big prizes for trivia backstage at this party. There'll be a special guest at this party. Ooh. Okay. There'll be a special guest, surprise special guest. That's I can't it. tell you who it is. But you four who win will, yeah, you'll be hooked up. And if that ain't enough, you four are going to be invited back on New Year's Eve oh, to be that. a part of the panel, to be a part of the show, our New Year's show. Wow. Fruitcake Tony's New Year's Rockin' Eve. That's awesome. As a part of your winnings from the Halenville Live Lost Year End Contest is what cool. we are calling it. That's awesome. Yeah. Man. So Love there'll it. be, as we approach December, there'll be promos out. You'll see a lot more of this image. Yeah. And, yeah. Some really cool stuff happening on Wednesday. Talk cool. about all things Van Halen because, hey. All roads, they do. Most certainly do. Yeah. All right. Cool. We're going we're gonna to wind things down, B. Yeah, man. Um, let, me, let me go over here. Tommy, Lenny, Lou, Ed... Nice to see all of you guys. Boomster back. Keith Campbell. Yep. You guys have a great weekend. Hope your Thanksgiving weekend has been awesome. Nice to see you. We'll be right back here next Saturday with Greg Collins talking about Kansas. Yeah. Cool. Um, Love it. Brandon, nice to see you, brother. Um, Steel Panther next Saturday yeah. for you, dude. Yeah, that'll be fun. Yeah. That'll um, be fun. On behalf of Brendan and Sandra and Charles, and thanks for watching. Leave a thumbs up on the video. Subscribe here if you're not already. Um, and please, please share these videos. Show me your pick and Halenville Live yeah. on your social media sites, yeah. wherever they are. That yeah. helps us grow. Yeah. Um, yeah. Congrats and to we Keith. appreciate that. Congrats we to Keith on do. winning tonight. And yep. Keith get that Cam to you, er, Keith. Yep. yep. Keith is the big winner. Good job. For the Eric Clapton pick tonight. Yep. Yeah. Awesome. Right on, Keith. All right, kiddos. All right. Um, yeah. So let's see. Let's do this before we go. Any any kids yeah. wanna um, hang out a moment in the green room after the the show here? There's a link I just popped in. Look at that. We'll be back there for a few. Um, yeah. Cool. All right. I'm getting a bunch of messages. I think Dave is at Machine Head at the machine shop. Oh, wow. Yeah. I'm getting a bunch of stuff from the show now. But, yeah, if you want to hang out a moment backstage, click that link. We'll be back there for a few. Come say hi. Nice to see everybody tonight. Brendan, nice to see you, brother. Nice to see We're you, cruising. brother. Yep. We're cruising out of here, dude. Here we are. Here Sounds we go. Good. Crank it up. Look out for that car. That's right. I we gone. And I can't get out.
Look out. Ooh. She's falling. Uh-oh. All right. <laughs> I Leon. Died by accident. Peace out. Peace. See ya. Macaroni with the chicken strip.